Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Oh, 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 there's, oh, there's multiples. <laughs> oh my God, where will he go? <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another video on Jurassic World Evolution 2, the Malta DLC, where some dinosaurs that we thought were coming to the previous, you know, Dominion DLC are now finally here. We've seen a trust or if you haven't seen the video, it's it's up there, it's up here somewhere, I don't know, in there. Anyway, go check that out. But today, or in this video, we're gonna be checking out uh, something very cute that I've completely, oh no, I always forgot the name, Lystrosaurus, that's the one. So, um, now, normally with these things, I'm like, oh, what kind of attack animation does it have with all these things? However, in this case, it's gonna be um, what has animations to kill it, because Lystrosaur, as you can probably tell by this, is incredibly tiny, but it is absolutely adorable, though. Blessed, look at you. You're so small, but very cute. So this is its 2022 skin. Um, I think there was one... Was it, I can't, They had a name. I think Kyla's had a name. She had a little Lystrosaur. She was sort of like as a pet. Um, so it is a herbivore, if I remember correctly. But... Uh, apparently, these, as well as Compsognathus, Morris and Trepidus, uh, have now attack animations to kill guests. So it's going to be very interesting to see how that works. Um, but without further ado, let's get into our first sort of attack animations. One I definitely want to see, and that is how does it face up against an Oviraptor? So Oviraptor is one of those dinosaurs that kind of, if any of them, look the most realistic. Like it has the feathers that it would probably have. It also has the weird sort of face that it would normally have. Uh, yeah, it's it's pretty much there. So I'm kind of curious. Oh, look at them. They do the little animation. Oh, it's so adorable. So it stretches its leg. It's such a cute social animation. Can't wait to see how these guys face up against an Oviraptor. These Lystrosauruses are like the random skins. We d I do have some batches that only have the uh, 2022 skins, but you know, it's, it, it's interesting to see what else they can have. And they are adorable. And all of them have little eyebrows. I love this shot, seeing them all just like around like a small body of water, because it makes them not look too small. Because this is a very small bit of water in comparison. Oh, they're still kind of drowning themselves. I see that. And that's a nice color. <laughs> but I also get flashbacks of um, that scene from, what was it? Uh, Walking with Dinosaurs with the last ones. I don't think they were Lystrosauruses. They were something else that got killed by a Postosuchus. I'm going to conduct a little experiment here. So... In the movie, these guys were in like a, a confined battle arena to fight each other, like illegal cuff fighting. So I'm wondering if we put them both in an even smaller enclosure, if they will then attack each other. <laughs> what about another tiny terror? Not as big as Oviraptor or as big as Lystrosaurus. Little compies. Can they even manage to have an attack animation on Lystrosaurus? They have it with nothing else. So it'll be interesting to see if they can. Oh, they actually like Lystrosaurus. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh, okay, these two work together then. Right, well, maybe something will happen there. Not too sure. What about something else that's maybe a little bit bigger than a compi? The Morris Intrepidus, the new dinosaur, a, or a new dinosaur, I should say, for this DLC. It would make sense if they did give them an attack animation together. Likes everything. It just doesn't like Indominus Rex, Indoraptor, or Scorpius Rex. Oh, okay. Oh, no. It's found them, and it likes them. Oh, look at the two cuties. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> okay, well, apparently everything, everything that's tiny gets on with each other. That's cool. Right, well, if that's the case, we might as well introduce something that definitely won't get on with them. And that is the Carnotaurus. Now, the Carnotaurus has an attack animation for most things. And it covers the spread of, like, you know, medium carnivores, medium to large carnivores. So, you know, it might not bother with the Compsognathus because it's a bit small, but something like a Lystrosaurus. Oh, oh, that's bad size now. So it likes Compies, it likes Morris Intrepidus, but it's indifferent to Lystrosaurus, meaning that it's probably going to kill it. No. Okay, so the Carnotaurus is kind of not even attacking any of them. 
it keeps on switching to like looking for food and then that turns off right away so no idea why it's not going after the little piggies in blankets apparently the carnotaurus is rather gonna starve to death than hunt down one of those kind of curious so we're gonna release an atrociraptor now i know the atrociraptor has an attack animation with Lystrosaurus. So I'd be very surprised if it does not attack it. Otherwise, now I'm just wondering if there's a glitch with the Lystrosaurus because surely the Overraptor, you know, after having the fight in the movie, uh, would have been one to do it? Right, but actually no. Okay, we're about to see this little Lystrosaur fight the dust and there it goes, oh, blizzard. Yeah, oh, chucked around. Okay, so the Trosraptor definitely has a kill animation for Lystrosaurus. Overraptor, Compi, Morris Intrepidus, Carnotaurus, all don't seem to have one for it. And he's so surprised that no one else has went for them either. He's like, what? Only me? Like, really? You're eating the Compies? And here it is from another angle. So I think what happens here, because we can't really see it in slow motion, uh, because I don't think that's still working, um, is that it'll jump over, surprise the, the uh, Lystrosaur, it'll try and be like, no, and then it'll get stood on and then attacked. <laughs> <laughs> and then what? Bless it. Well, there you have it. Another one dead. And unfortunately, yeah, these guys live in harmony. The Lystrosaur isn't happy about the Carnotaurus, but the Carnotaurus doesn't care and isn't even going to kill him. So we'll just clean up our mess and then get some other things in here. Right, if there's something that I would have thought would have an animation to kill them, it's of course the only other thing that isn't technically a dinosaur. And that is Dimetrodon. It's also a quadruped. It walks on all fours. And it's around about the same level, you know, that you could easily make an animation of Dimetrodon just kind of snapping one up. It's also indifferent to Lystrosaurus. It's also doing this thing where it's looking for food and then it goes to roaming. So maybe there's an animation that's there, but it's, it's just not quite working. Well, you know, if there's something that is kind of on the same level, or at least on all fours, the only other thing... Oh, look at that. Surely you can, like, flick it up in the air and then catch it, shake it around and throw it. I mean, that's the animation that I would love to see. If I was an animator or on the project, I'd be like, make that. So let's see if they are able or even happy. No. I don't believe this. You're telling me the Indoraptor is happy enough to eat one of these, like, when it's dead, but it's not gonna hunt one? What? Why? Yeah, it's definitely hungry. It's going from one to the other and just picking the corpse clean, but it's not gonna hunt a live one. This is so strange. The only animation that I've seen work is a Trosoraptor. Nothing likes it. This is like the freaking dodo. So, if an Indoraptor, a Carnotaurus won't kill it, what about an absolute Titan? The one, the only T-Rex. God, since Jurassic Park, you're gonna run straight to a rock, aren't you? Yep, there we go. Oh, but cool entrance though, nonetheless. Be cool if you flipped out and boink, because <laughs> of the rock. But will one of these massive T-Rexes that would not have a problem eating a Lystrosaur eat a Lystrosaur? I'm losing my mind over here. I really don't know what I can do. Can we put some sauce on it? Or um, can we get some to have sauce with mayonnaise or something? Anything. Just a lather on top of it. Yep, doesn't like T-Rex, but uh, I mean, doesn't like a lot of things. It like specifically says over after over after carnivores and there is in a source. However, we have an Overaptor and a friggin' Lystrosaur in here, and they're not fighting each other. I feel like maybe this this must be a patch that's gonna be fixed. Starting to run out of ideas. Is the friggin' Brachiosaur gonna have anima animations with them? I don't even know, but how about a Therizinosaurus? They specifically say does not like Therizinosaurus. So... Is it gonna, like, swipe at them? Or will it ignore them? I don't know. Or maybe they all jump and attack it. God, anything at this point. You could have done so much. You could have had, like, there is an Asaurus swipe it into oblivion. You could have had it stab its fingers into the, you know, into it, into the ground, and, like, be like, ah, get off. And you haven't done anything with this? Not even the overwrap. They're not gonna boot that. If there's something that maybe, you know, it's in the same kind of pack, the new Dimorphodon could have an attack animation with it. Would be quite interesting. All right, and just in case there's another dinosaur that might have animations for it, 
let's put out the Quetzalcoatlus as well. I can see, you know, picking it up, just eating one hole, a bit like it did with the humans. All right, we've got the Quetzalcoatlus in here. We've also got the tiny little Dimorphodon also in here. Will they pick a fight with the Lystrosaurus or just eat it? Or do nothing, which is also an option, apparently, that everything else is selected. Okay, we're going to make Celiophysis, Dilophosaurus, and Monolophosaurus to see if these guys have an attack animation with them as well. So, first, why not? Let's start with a Dilophosaurus. Never know. Maybe we'll get lucky. Go on, then. Here we go. Oh, oh. He's like, move! I want to eat your face. You, you're gonna, you're gonna get, get go with the go-go? No? <laughs> it's just like, any second now, you'll be in the right position, and I can start any second. There it is. Oh, yeah, exactly like Atrocerus. I thought so. So we definitely know that there is an animation that works, and it's mainly for the small theropod carnivores. We'll see if the Celia Physis has, like, a different animation. It's a little bit smaller, but again, it is a theropod carnival. So if it's going to have a different animation, you never know. Here we go. You ready? Whoa! Yeah! Easy killed. Oh, yep. It does have a kill animation for Lystrosaur. Is it going to be something different? Could it be? I don't know. Apparently, maybe Lystrosaur has attack animations for human beings, so... That would be quite interesting. I'd love if it just ran into one, a guy fell over, and then, like, when it fell over, oh, it's the same. Yeah, it's pretty much the same. And a neck that probably isn't as strong to kill it. A little bit different, but it's pretty much the same. So with that in mind, let's make a bunch of compies, a bunch of Lystrosaurs, and a bunch of Morus Intrepidus, and just see what their attack animations are on the human beings. <laughs> oh, well, at least we got to see this cute animation up close again. Oh, he's so adorable. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Oh, 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 there's, oh, there's multiples. <laughs> oh, my God. Where did he go? They're like magnets everywhere. Oh, oh, oh my God. She turned to jello. I'm going to blame that on the venom. You know, you have some creatures that have like venom that turns, um, like blood into jello. Well, they have it, but it turns the bones into jello. We need more copies. Release them all. Oh, we've got another dude being attacked by copies everywhere. I wonder how many it takes to kill him. I love how sometimes he will grab one and, and throw it. Oh, 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 well, there we go. You know, natural selection really is what that was. Any more? Any more deaths? Oh, we got another one over there. No. <laughs> At least the copies don't look like they're being injured. Oh, they, well, they all kind of like, oh, I threw it against a brick wall. The inhumanity. I mean, if you can't defend yourself from some copies, then, I mean, oh, oh <laughs> then there's really no help for you. Go and kill him, my pretties. Kill him. Oh, yes. I mean, if you're just going to stand around and not even try and run away, and you kind of, this is going to happen. You deserve it. <laughs> so many of them. Oh, yes, look at them go. All at once, my pretties. Yes. They don't even eat them. They just kind of like kill them and then go, oh, okay, we're done. Bye. <laughs> oh, we've got the Morris Intrepidus. Okay, they have the same animation. Okay, so it's like a pack mental. Oh, my goodness. Is it dead? Oh, my God. I think he killed it. Yeah. Uh, oh, wait. Wait. They all... They all died! Everybody died! No! They killed him! Can I sue him? He killed my dinosaurs! This amount of human beings are being terrified by a tiny Comsognathus. You can stand on it, for God's sake. Took long enough, but here we go. He's not being attacked by a hundred compies, which is a bit of a bugger, but he is being attacked by quite a few. Probably the same amount that maybe killed you to stock. Oh, he threw one! Is it dead, though? No, it's alive. And how are you going to die? I may I ask? Oh, 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 he went under your legs. <laughs> and that's how you died. Pitiful. Well, it seems like we had a two for one here. Except for this guy is not, you know. Oh, no. Oh, there he goes. Okay. This is how it starts. He's like, no, no, don't, don't. And then they all just sort of surround him. Oh, where did he go? He sort of ran up his pant leg. Oh, the game. Oh, the game is starting to chug. Let's watch you die in like now 30 FPS because the game's starting to break. There you go. 
<laughs> okay, guys, before the game completely explodes on itself, we're going to wrap up the video here. My god, I did not expect that to turn out the way it did. Apparently, nothing has animations for anything or to do with Lystrosaur uh, or even Morris Intrepidus, which is a bit of a bugger, or even Overraptor. I mean, a couple of things. I think Overraptor just kind of gets killed by most things. But yeah, anyway, if you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye-bye.